Hello, I am from the Goya of St. Demetrios, and I would like to share with you the sixth lesson of our introduction to the creed of our faith. There are two very important words used for Jesus in the creed. The first is the word only begotten. This is a word from the New Testament for Jesus, and it is another way to emphasize that he is God. To understand why the word is important, we have to listen to its use just a little later in the creed, where we say that Jesus is begotten, not created. Some translations are a little different and say that Jesus is begotten, not made. What is the difference between being begotten and being created or made? When we beget something, we are producing something that is just like us. A human being begets a human child. A tree begets another tree. And if Jesus is begotten of God, it means that he is also divine. When we create something, we produce something different from us. We beget human children, but we create a house or a book or a table. So, if Jesus is begotten and not made, it means that in the words of the creed, he is light from true light and God from true God. Human beings are created by God and made by God. Jesus is begotten. The second important word in the creed is the Greek word homosios. The word is translated into English either as of one essence with the Father or a consubstantial with the Father. It is another way of saying that Jesus is begotten. It means that whatever the Father is, Jesus is also. If the Father is immortal, Jesus is immortal. If the Father is without sin, then Jesus is without sin. There is human nature, which all humans share, and there is divine nature, which Jesus shares with the Father. This is the one word in the creed that is not from the Bible. It is a philosophical word, and it was controversial because many people only wanted to use biblical language in the creed. The word was finally used because it expressed better than any other word that Jesus was truly God. These two words, then, are very important for saying that Jesus is God. He is begotten of the Father, and he is homosios, or of one essence with the Father. Please listen to the next lecture where we discuss the human identity of Jesus Christ.